Can you hear me now? Good. Well, hello. Welcome back. Got some things done in the shop. Not as much as I like to, but some anyway. A uh, couple new cabinets. Got this thing above my head. Made a couple rolling carts. Uh, still have some more to make actually in the uh, dust collection I'm going to put together. Got a new drill press. It was used, but new to me. Also, uh, don't leave drill bits in your drill press. Because, like, you cut yourself. Now the only thing I really need is a uh, decent bandsaw. And to get my X-Carb in here. Hey, me from the future here. I've made some changes since then. It's actually been probably about six months since I made that video. Um, as you can see, uh, the layout of the garage is a little different. I have moved things kind of centralized here. The rolling carts are here. Got the outfeed table all set up. I still need to add the extension to the table saw, the uh, 52 inch extension, um, but uh, there's should be plenty of room for that. Um, I did get a new bandsaw. That is a 14 inch jet bandsaw with a 13 inch resaw. Uh, I also forgot to point out last time that I do have a Harbor Freight flex core welder. So I also made this workbench right here. Um, this is where the X-Carb is going to live. This is also on casters. Again, um, most of the stuff over here is on casters, this workbench. The, uh, the plasma over here, and then with the plasma being there and the X-Carb here, I moved my Mac Mini here uh, in the middle. It used to be over there where the bandsaw is, but this is more centrally located. And of course, um, I can move it around and tuck it away. So um, that's pretty convenient as well. Um, but the, the main thing was uh, just getting everything kind of set up and where it needs to go and kind of getting this shot back into a workable <laughs> situation and not just have things cluttered. Though clearly things are still kind of cluttered. Um, but it's that's a, a lot better than it was. Um, now it's just about kind of organizing things better and getting them onto the shelves over here and, and the storage unit. And I also replaced this one storage shelf over here. Uh, the other one was plastic. I now have two of those inside the house um, for storing things I've already made and shipping supplies, um, things like that. I also picked up the Ryobi 6 battery charger just a little more convenient because I only had two chargers before. So I was constantly switching batteries and at least now I can kind of keep them charged ahead of time. All right, well, I'm now returning to your present or your past. Let's go this way. Yeah, so having those on casters is gonna help quite a bit. This workbench, those, uh, the Crossfire Plasma CNC, that tool chest, the x card when I get it, those will all be on wheels. So I can just move things around whenever I need it. And that kind of helps with this small shop or garage or whatever. Another thing that actually won't be on wheels will be dust collection, that drill press, table saw, and this workbench, which I'm gonna kind of use as like a an outfeed table for that. 
So yeah, speaking of table saws, I also got this uh, Rockler crosscut sled. It's been pretty good so far. It's been coming in handy. I think that about does it for now. Um, it's a nice little mini shop update for you. So remember to like, subscribe, until next time.